The last time we checked in on Texas Governor Rick Perry, he had pulled out of the Republican presidential primary after forgetting the name of a federal department he wanted to shut down. Now he's back in the spotlight. Democrats blocked a Perry-backed abortion bill with a filibuster, and he's been pretty outspoken about it. Emily Ramshaw has been covering Perry for years for our partner, the Texas Tribune. Emily, might his defense of conservative principles help Perry politically? You know, I think that's really a high likelihood. Look, he was delivered a setback last week when Democrats filibustered this abortion bill that Perry really had made a calling card of his. Now he's been out, you know, on the national scene sort of saying, there's no way this bill isn't going to pass. I'm putting my full weight behind it and, you know, behaving like somebody who might even be running for president. What about Perry's criticism of Wendy Davis, the Democrat who led the filibuster? So Perry made what many saw as a very personal attack against Wendy Davis. Even the woman who filibustered the Senate the other day was born into difficult circumstances. He spoke to the National Right to Life Convention and basically said, you know, Wendy Davis was a single mother herself. She was raised by a single mother. She should have learned for her, from her own example, you know, and supported this legislation. Was that a spontaneous thing or do you think that was totally planned out? You know, I think it was planned out. I do not think this was spontaneous, but anybody who knows Rick Perry will tell you that this was a, a political attack. You know, in many ways, he was talking about her in, in this way to sort of cast her in a light that made him look like a staunch social conservative to maybe sort of rally the troops among Tea Party folks. You know, I think he was really looking at this saying, you know, this is an opportunity for me to shine. Uh, finally, Emily, you mentioned presidential politics. Is that a possibility? Is he really thinking about it? You know, it's really too early to tell. We're expecting to hear from Perry possibly as early as next week on whether he's going to run for governor again. Uh, sort of the common thought right now is that he's not running for governor. But I think he said he's going to say by the end of the year whether he's running for president. Look, right now he's, he's behaving like it. He's talking the talk. He's walking the walk. I think it's just going to be whether he thinks he has the opportunity. Thank you, Emily.